Okay, so we're going to take a look at the talking calculator. You've used it basically for some of the basic functions, but we're going to look a little bit more at some of the specific things that it can do. So, do you remember how to turn it on? A large green yeah. button at the bottom right. And the on button. Okay, and I think the volume's already on, but go ahead and check and see. Where's the volume button? That's it. Switch beneath the screen. And you can have it in two different settings. That's off, and middle one is not as loud. Next one to the right is louder. There you go. Okay, and take a look at the three buttons that are at the top right, because you've seen those and asked me about those. Yes, I see them very <laughs> Good. So you remember reset, which is the one on the left. There you go. Is when we have to replace the battery, we have to hit the reset so that the calculator will goes back to how its settings were before. Okay, the one in the middle says UD. I put Braille sticker just above that. It says UD. Did you see that? Yes. Okay. Do you know what that button does? No. Okay, if you press it and it beeps once, so go ahead and press it. Okay, that means that the total number will be read as digits. So go ahead and put a number in, four numbers. Five, five, six. Okay, and add plus. Plus. And six. He moves his finger along the keyboard. Right there, yep. Six. Okay, and hit equal. Equal. Okay, so when it's in, when the one beep does, it reads it as its number using the place values, 562. Now, go up to the UD and press it again. Okay, no beep. Uh, clear, clear the number you've got on there. Clear. Okay, now do it. Clear. Now press the UD button. Okay, now when it beeps twice, put a number in, like two, two, two five, five, plus... Plus. Six. Six. And equals. Equals. Three, one. Three, one. Instead of saying 31, it says three, one. It just reads the digits. Equals. Three, seven. Three, seven. Okay. So three, seven. So um, do you like it to read 37 or three, seven? 30, 37. Okay. So hit the UD button again. So that it beeps once. There we go. Okay. Two. So. Five. On. Okay, go ahead. Equals 25. There we go. Good. Okay. Very good. Okay, so up there on the to the right of the UD button, what does that say? He reads the Braille with his index it finger. Says, hmm. Okay, it says A O, I should say A R O, okay. but I just put. R O A R O is on there, yeah. So I'm used to reading with two <laughs> Say okay, so press that. Let's clear the number on there. There you go. Dear. Okay. There we go. Okay, so you heard the beep from the A R O. So press five plus sign. Did you hear it did it say five? No. no. Hit the plus sign. Hit three and hit equal. Equal eight. Okay, it did not read the numbers you put no. in to do the math. That's what the ARO does. So go ahead and hit ARO again so that it will say all the numbers. There you go. And clear the number eight out of there. Clear. Okay, now if we go to the, there are six buttons below those three. Take a feel. He moves his fingers down. Okay. And that's, uh, hit each one. Memory zero. Okay, so there's nothing in the memory of the calculator. That's what that means. Now go to the one to the right of that. Memory clear. So if there was something in there, you've just cleared it. Okay, now go to the one below MR. Memory minus. Memory minus, so you're taking something out of memory. Memory plus. Okay, you're adding something into memory. Okay, memory plus adds a number into the memory, so. And the bottom two numbers, the bottom two numbers, and the bottom two letters, C-E. Yes. Okay, so put a number in, any number. Five. Okay, plus. Plus. Any number. Three. 
Okay, let's say you don't want three, you meant to hit four. Okay, press that C E button. It goes for the button Not to the that right. One, right there. Press clear. that. It cleared the three. It didn't clear the five. Mm. So now put four in. Hit four, four and hit equal. Equal. Nine. Nine. So that C E button clears the just the last number you've put in there. But now let's do clear that. If you hit clear. C E twice, it clears everything. So hit it again. There. It's clear. Clear. Now Let's do where you put in, put in two numbers, something plus something. Four plus three. Okay, now hit the AC button, which is to the right of the CE button. All clear. All clear. That clears everything out, not just the last number. Okay, so now well, let's go down. You know the on button. Below those are the on and the off button. That's on. Presses on, then okay. off. And then off. Okay. And then on. So let's say put three numbers in. Something plus something. Seven. Plus. Plus. Six. Plus. Plus. One. One. Okay, and let's say you can't remember what the last number was you put in. Hit the REP number. A large button. It's right there. One. To the left of the off button. One. So the last one. number you put in was one. So that tells you. Now hit equal. Equal. Fourteen. Okay, and then you get busy and something happens and you can't remember what the answer was. So what button are you going to hit then? Touches repeat. Fourteen. Fourteen. So that reminds you of what there was. Okay, any questions about... The different things? Mm, no, Wondering no, about anything else? Nope. On the calculator? Okay. So does that kind of help? There's little tiny things that really help you when you know the details of yes. how they work. So. He turns it off. Okay. That sounds great, and I think we're done for today.